Weeks after being let out of a Minneapolis courtroom in handcuffs for the murder of George Floyd, former police officer Derek Chauvin is now facing new federal civil rights charges. It sends a message that equal justice is possible in America. The indictment says Chauvin deprived Floyd of his constitutional right to be free from the use of unreasonable force by a police officer. Chauvin and three other officers also face a charge for failing to give Floyd medical aid. The federal grand jury also returned a second indictment against Chauvin in connection with the 2017 incident in which Chauvin allegedly held a 14-year-old student by the throat and struck him multiple times in the head with a flashlight. Why didn't prosecutors bring up that case during the previous trial? Gabe, prosecutors wanted to bring up the case, but the judge ruled that he was going to limit their ability to get into past wrongs involving Derek Chauvin. He also made it clear that if prosecutors went too far, he'd declare the case a mistrial. Chauvin's attorney declined to comment on the new federal indictments, but he's appealed for a new trial on the state charges, in part because of the pretrial publicity. And he claims that the jury felt race-based pressure during the proceedings. Attorneys for the other three officers also declined or could not be reached for comment. They are scheduled to head to trial together on state charges of aiding and abetting murder and manslaughter later this summer. Gabe Gutierrez, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.